Adventureland is the first text adventure game for microcomputers, released by Scott Adams in 1978. It was very successful and led Adams to form Adventure International, which went on to publish 13 similar games in the Adventure series, each in different settings. The game involves the search for 13 lost artifacts in a fantasy setting. Gameplay Gameplay involves moving between the various locations found within the game, collecting found objects and often subsequently using them, generally in another location, and the solving of puzzles. The game commands take the form of either simple, two-word, verb, noun phrases, such as, "...climb tree", or one-word commands, such as those used for player character movement, including north, south, east, west, up, and down. Although the game has a vocabulary of about 120 words, the parser only recognized the first three letters. This meant that the parser occasionally identified a word incorrectly, but also that commands could be truncated, for example, lig lamb would be interpreted as light lamp. In order to complete the game, the player has to collect the 13 lost artifacts, a statue of Paul Bunyan's blue ox, babe, the jeweled fruit, the golden fish, a dragon's egg, a golden net, a magic carpet, a diamond necklace, a diamond bracelet, a pot of rubies, the royal honey, a crown, a magic mirror, and a firestone. Unlike succeeding adventure games, Adventureland has no story or plot, it is simply a treasure hunt. The game was available on a number of platforms, including the Apple II series of computers, and various computers released by Atari, Commodore International, and Texas Instruments. A cut-down, three-treasure version entitled Adventure Zero, Special Sampler was also made available at a special low price. In 1982, Adventureland was re-released with graphics, thus enabling the player to view visible representations of the scenery and objects to be found within the game. Topic Development. Adventureland, Adam's first program, is a slightly scaled-down machine language game similar to the original adventure program. The source code for Adventureland was published in Softside magazine in 1980, and the database format was subsequently used in other interpreters such as Brian Howarth's Mysterious Adventures series. Reception Mark Harrow for Dragon commented that I can't recommend any version of Scott Adams' adventure series highly enough. Beg, borrow, or steal a chance to play adventure. <laughs>